All righty, welcome back to Outnumbered. So, here <laughs> in New York, Senator Kirsten Gildebrand, Gildebrand. Gildebrand. my senator for like 18 years, I should know it, talking about how she didn't respond to sexist comments she says she got on the job and explaining why she stayed silent. The Democrat from New York has already shared a bit of what happened, claiming male colleagues remarked on her weight during and after her pregnancy. I mean, that's just wrong. Some say she should have stuck up for herself, but here's Gildebrand on a comment she says a labor leader made and how she reacted. I just had a baby. I'm, I've just been appointed. I have a lot to learn, so much on my plate, and this man basically says to me, you're too fat to, get a, to, to be elected statewide. And at that moment, if I could have just disappeared, I would have. If I could have just melted in tears, I would have. But I had to just sit there and talk to him, and I switched the subject, and I didn't hear another word he said. Um, but it wasn't a place where I could tell him to go himself. Um, I was in a later conversation, which I do describe. Yeah, yeah. I do Same tell my somebody I know well, and I, I kind of un unleashed on him. But um, anyway, uh, the, the reality for women in the workplace, and this is the broader issue, is we get comments like this all the time. And when you get comments like that all the time, as horrific as they may be, but you're brand new on the on the new team, she's on playing on one of the biggest stages in the world, mm -hmm. the United States Senate. Oh, you guys tell okay, me. Okay, here's what I, mean, I would what, say. You, what I, happens? If, if a man actually said that. Okay, but wait, put yourself in her shoes. She yeah. just got appointed. She didn't even get elected yeah. to the United States Senate. Yeah. She's very insecure sure. with everything that's going on. Yeah. Now what happens? I would say um, I may be baby fat, but you're working with a Twizzler, and at least I can get on a treadmill and lose weight. Wow. Okay, she goes right for the Yeah, that's absolutely jugular. right, and that's okay. exactly what you do. Okay. You go wow. lower than the jugular. Okay. That's exactly what See, you do. See, I'm opposite. I mean, uh, honestly, until huh? she made the comments that she, you know, the reasons why she couldn't tell him to go blank, blank <laughs> himself, I was thinking that she took the high road, you know, which uh, in, in until some... Until she started talking. Oh, my gosh. You know, and and know, I, don't know I guess that's kind of out the door. Can quite possibly take the low road on that. I, I mean, <laughs> uh, you know what? That Can we was just, the Did anybody road. bet the book? <laughs> I mean, if this is really true, why didn't she go to the ethics committee? What? And by this the way, if she, if she can cuss like a sailor, why didn't she cuss him out? Exactly. Because, have, because, him, have a snappy come back home and I'd be like, you know, she, I'm not buying this. I don't know. Blah, blah. blah boring. What? She's and, boring to me. I mean, I, you know, I don't know. I don't like, I didn't <laughs> mind her so much before, but now she's kind of annoying because here she's like, oh, HuffPost Live, I'm going to bring my A game. I'm going to talk like this. I'm happening. Well, you know what? You didn't take the opportunity when you had the chance. Yeah. So now I just Easy find the, the whole Monday thing. Morning she's, she's, yeah, we're, we're, I'm for Plus, breakfast I mean, this morning. Not as enough. As a, as Only a, one piece of bacon. Look, as a leader, as a lawmaker, I would think that she would want to, no matter how fresh and new she was on the job, enjoying some new car smell or whatever. That's right. Her experience. Prison fight. No matter what it was, I just think that as a leader, an appointed New leader, she okay. would say to herself, so, to protect the other young women in, in the offices here on, on Capitol Hill, I should go and, and put on record that there's an abuser but, in our presence. Oh, look, I'm going to speak for myself. When I was a younger lawyer who hadn't been in all the different courthouses, I definitely conducted myself differently. I was walking on eggshells. I was Even figuring when people things abused out. You? Oh, people have been abusing me since I was 10. I had buck teeth. They call me Bucky the Buck Tooth Beaver. So I'm used to I it. Think it's I lost my you. hair and all that stuff. So my only point oh, no. is, as offensive as it was, as 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 offensive as it was, I can understand her oh at God. that point holding her tongue. You just missed it, Harris. Just uh, what you say? Nice thing about me? Well, well, kind the, of. The she said she likes the... your buck teeth, but I was saying you don't have them anymore. Well, whatever. I mean, it's you know, <laughs> everyone loves me for what's inside. No one loves me once you're talking to I look like a rake. A girl yeah. used to be one of the only females on a commodities trading floor. Yeah, you must have heard it all. Listen, I've heard a lot of things, and it's all about how you want to handle it and how right. you want to deal with it. And um, in my opinion, what doesn't kill you only makes you it stronger. It didn't bother you, did it? No, it didn't bother me. It didn't bother bit. me either. Yes, but you would send to say, "Oh, just sit there and just take it." But and listen, it really not, it, Kimberly, I won't say that didn't doesn't make me think less about certain people. You know, sure. but that's I depends don't know on what they say. Certain, I don't need to spend my. Did you feel? But you were the only one, so probably there wouldn't have been other young women to what look was out the for. Only one, but. but you probably, I'm, I'm sure you though, in the back of your mind, it, look, look if this gets pervasive. I'm going to deal with it. I, wanna, I don't want I, anybody else to get. I was going to say, I want to make it clear that there are instances where there's absolutely wrong things that are said and done in this world. But listen, you know. She's coming out now and talking about. I'm with Kimberly. I'm kind of bored of the conversation. If you didn't do something about it, then why are we still talking? They're about not it? a hero now. To she <laughs> had her chance, and now she's trying to sell books. Okay, that's the reality. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's reality. probably is the reality, Kimberly. 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 Kimberly.
for yeah. you. <laughs> well, no, there's salami in the green room, so these last eight minutes, oh, we're not numbered. Over and we know Don't talk about